We are going to begin with powerful prayers to help you start your day just right. And one of the core things to do is show gratitude and thanksgiving. If you are grateful for where you are and what you have, you will stand a greater chance of getting where you need to be. Let's pray. I want you to start your day with a heart full of gratitude because you can only receive new things from God when you are grateful for the previous things He had already done. In Psalm 118 verse 24, the scripture says, This is the day that the Lord has made. Let us rejoice and be glad in it. Dear Lord, I come before you with a heart overflowing with gratitude for the gift of a new day. Your word teaches that each day is created by you. Today, I express my gratitude for the breath of life, for the opportunities that lie ahead of me today, and for the chance to walk in your will. Thank you for saving me. Thank you for choosing me. Thank you for living in me. I do not take it for granted. I thank you, Lord, for the beauty of creation that you surround me with. The sun, the wind, and all other creations. They are a constant reminder of your greatness and kindness towards me. For you created all things because of me. Thank you for your divine provisions that never fails. As I embrace this new day, help me to carry an attitude of gratitude in every step I take. Lord, Open my eyes to the blessings that may go unnoticed, the warmth of sunlight, the smile of a loved one, the ability to move and talk, and the simple joys that make life precious. Help me to be grateful for every little thing. In my moments of challenges, please remind me to turn my heart toward thanksgiving instead of complaints. Help me to remember that even in the difficulties you are working things out for my good. I am grateful for the love and grace you pour into my life. I am grateful for the daily blessings you give to me. I also pray for divine guidance today. The book of Proverbs chapter 3 verses 5 to 6 say, Trust in the Lord with all your heart and do not rely on your own understanding. In all your ways acknowledge Him and He will direct your paths. Dear Father, I come before you today acknowledging that I rely only on your wisdom I trust in you completely and surrender my limited understanding to you. You know what is best for me. You know where I ought to be. And I place my plans and decisions in your hands. Grant me clarity to face the challenges and decisions ahead of me each day. Help me to seek your guidance in everything I do. May my thoughts, words, and actions align with your will because I know that your plans are higher than mine. I leave my paths in your hands, Lord, and I believe that you will guide me to all the blessings you have for me. Take away worries and concerns from my life and guide me towards the purpose you have for me. Enlighten my mind with your truth so that I can walk in clarity. 
I declare that I will not walk in confusion, nor in darkness. As scriptures say, Your word is a lamp to my feet and a light to my path. As I begin this day, may the Holy Spirit be my guide. May he lead me with love and wisdom according to the will of the Father for my life. I pray that you open up my heart and cause me to constantly yield to you, Lord. In Jesus' name, Amen. Make this declaration on yourself and ask your loved ones to join too. I choose to be grateful and joyful for each day that I am alive. I am grateful for the air that I breathe, the meals I eat, the water I drink, the shelter I have over my head, and the people that surround me. I receive the grace to be grateful for all that I have and will still have. I declare that I have good success, and everything I lay my hands upon prospers. I declare that I am guided and directed by God every day. There will never be a moment when I lack His guidance and direction. I declare that I have the strength to overcome the challenges that will come on my road to success and prosperity. May I experience God's amazing strength in my times of weakness. I declare God's blessings, protection, grace and peace upon my life and that of my loved ones in Jesus' name. Amen. Let's continue praying. Philippians chapter 4 and verse 13 says, I can do all things through Him who strengthens me. Lord, give me the grace to face the demands of this day and overcome every hurdle I will face in my journey to living a blessed, successful, and prosperous life. I know that blessings do not come solely by my hard work, but by your grace and mercy. I receive this grace and mercy in a renewed way today, in Jesus' name. I declare that I will experience ease and speed in this year. I will achieve even more than I have planned or anticipated in Jesus' name. I acknowledge this morning that I depend totally on your strength and I pray that I will continue to draw all the strength I will need for each day from you. Give me the inner strength to navigate challenges and the courage to face adversity. In my moments of weakness, I pray that I find my refuge and strength in you. You said in your word, that your strength is made perfect in my weakness. I declare my trust in you as the source of my strength. May I not rely solely on my abilities, but lean on your limitless power. Help me to persevere with resilience and determination, for with you, I can overcome any obstacle. I declare that your strength is my anchor in the face of uncertainties. Fill me with the confidence to trust you. Thank you because I am now empowered by your might. Numbers 6 and verse 24 to 26 says, The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face to shine upon you and be gracious to you. The Lord lift up his countenance upon you and give you peace. Heavenly Father, I stand before you with a heart open to receive your abundant blessings for me today. Thank you for your favor and grace in my life. I ask that you pour out your blessings upon every aspect of my life. May your blessings, O Lord, surround me like a shield 
and provide protection and guidance in my path. Keep me in the shelter of your love. Let your face shine upon me and be gracious to me. Lift up your countenance upon me and give me peace. As I prepare to go into my day, I ask that you'd be gracious to me and my loved ones. I know that I am undeserving, yet you shower me with unmerited favor, and for that I am grateful. May your favor open doors of opportunity, and may your grace be evident in every part of my life. May your presence fill my heart with joy and peace as I step into a new day. May your blessing be like a gentle breeze, refreshing and renewing my spirit in Jesus' name. As I aim for prosperity and incredible blessings every day, I pray that you give me the grace to trust your process and patterns. Because at the end, you always work in ways that I cannot see. I also seek for clarity of purpose today. I do not merely desire success, but I wish to understand the role it plays in my divine purpose on earth. Your words in Jeremiah 29 verse 11 says, For I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord, plans for welfare and not for evil, to give you a future and a hope. Jesus, I come to you with a yearning to align my life with the purpose you have ordained for me. Thank you for your promises that constantly fills me with hope and expectation for the future. Grant me the wisdom to discern your purpose for my life. May my steps be guided by your plan, and may I find fulfillment in pursuing the path you've set for me. In times of uncertainty, remind me that you hold the master plan for my life. Assist me in submitting my personal ambitions to follow your perfect will and help me trust in your superior plans. I pray for the guidance of the Holy Spirit this morning. I pray He reveals the unique purpose you have designed for me. As I journey through each day, may I move with intention and understand that each step I take plays a part in your grand design. I embrace the purpose you have for me, and I trust that it will continue to unfold according to your divine timing. Thank you, Lord, for assuring me that my life holds meaning and purpose within your eternal plan. And thank you for your blessings and for your eternal presence in my life. In Jesus' name I have prayed. Amen. The Lord will give you great blessings and success. May His plans for you come into fruition in Jesus' name. May His presence continue to shield your life. May you not be stranded at any junction you find yourself in life. As you begin a new day for a blessed morning prayer, it is important to understand the value of praying over specific areas of your life. And today, we'll focus on the financial aspect. Through this prayer, God will go before you to make a way for a financial breakthrough. Let's start with a prayer for provision. Philippians chapter 4 verse 19 says, And my God will supply every need of yours according to his riches and glory in Christ Jesus. Dear Lord, I come to you full of gratitude and acknowledging that you are the ultimate provider. Your word assures me that you will meet all my needs from your riches and glory. 
Today, I place my financial concerns in your hands, trusting in your never-ending provision. I trust in your ability to care for my needs, both big and small. When faced with financial challenges, help me to find comfort in the fact that your provision goes beyond what I see here on earth. Help me to stay in faith until I experience a breakthrough. Thank you, because your abundance surpasses any luck in my life. Lord, give me the wisdom to manage your provisions responsibly. Help me to be a responsible steward of all that you have given to me. Help me use what you've given me in ways that follow your will and bring honor to your name. No matter what happens to the world economy, help me to find peace in your provision and trust that you are my ultimate source. I rely on your wisdom, Lord, for it's by your wisdom that I can expand my financial capacity. Help me to know the kind of businesses to do, the kind of investments to make, and the kind of jobs to do. I pray that the Holy Spirit enlightens my mind and leads me in managing my finances in a way that honors you. Help me to know the right financial decisions to make each day. I receive the grace to sow the seeds that I should and take my harvest when they come. I will not break any financial laws in your word in Jesus' name. In times of confusion, show me the way forward as I learn and seek financial knowledge for my journey in life. Let your wisdom be the foundation of my financial decisions. Lord, I ask for the grace for diligence in my finances. Proverbs 21 and verse 5 says, The plans of the diligent lead surely to abundance, but everyone who is hasty comes only to poverty. Lord, I come before you with a heart determined to embrace diligence in my financial pursuits. Your word teaches me that the efforts of the diligent lead to abundance. Today, I seek diligence because I know it is the key to unlocking financial prosperity. Lord, fill me with the spirit of diligence that helps me persevere through challenges, learn from setbacks, and remain unwavering in the pursuit of my financial goals. I receive the grace for tireless commitment and an unwavering work ethic in my daily activities. May I be financially diligent and understand that success also requires persistent efforts and focused determination. As I engage in work and financial planning, may my diligence open doors of opportunity and guide me towards the abundance you have in store for me. In times of weariness, Lord, renew my strength. Grant me resilience when challenges arise. Lord, may my diligence be a testament to your faithfulness and reflect the excellence you've sowed into me. Thank you, Father, for the gift of diligence, for it aligns with your desire for me to manage my talents and resources responsibly, in Jesus' name. Make this declaration upon yourself using the scripture that has been shared in the prayers. I declare that God has made a way for my financial breakthrough. I declare that the Lord will meet all my needs according to His riches and glory by Christ Jesus. I declare that I will work in divine wisdom daily. 
I will make sound decisions that pertain to my finances. I declare that I will walk in diligence and perseverance. I will play the key roles I need to generate wealth and abundance in Jesus' name. I will not be lazy, neither will I slack at the work that God places in my hands. I receive the grace to give my best and enjoy the blessings that flow from it. I declare that I have the grace to be generous to other people. My life will be a channel of God's blessings to my world. I receive the grace to be content with what the Lord gives me and may my heart not be deceived or drawn away from God because of material things. I walk in these virtues of gratitude, wisdom, diligence, generosity, and content every single day of my life. In Jesus' name, Amen. Let's continue praying. In 2 Corinthians chapter 9 and verse 11, it is reading, You will be enriched in every way to be generous in every way, which through us will produce thanksgiving to God. Dear Lord, I come before you with an open heart, inviting the spirit of generosity into my life. Your word teaches that your blessing in my life is meant for the purpose of generosity. Today, I pray for a heart that gives the way you do. Help me to reflect your boundless love and grace in all my financial endeavors. In Jesus' name, Lord, nurture within me a spirit of generosity that goes beyond financial giving. May I generously share my time, talents, and resources because at the end, true wealth is found not only in the accumulation of money, but in selfless giving. I declare my commitment to be a channel of your blessings, a vessel through which your generosity flows into the lives of others. May my acts of kindness inspire others to draw close to you, Give me the grace to make a positive financial impact on those around me. As I encounter financial abundance, may my immediate response be to share with those in need. May my generosity reflect your love and be a testament to what defines your character. You gave Jesus to the world even when we did not deserve it. Thank you for your nature of selfless giving. And thank you, Lord, for granting me the privilege of being a channel of your generosity. Help me to embrace the joy of giving and strive to cultivate a generous spirit that brings glory to your name. Amen. 1 Timothy chapter 6 and verse 6 says, But godliness with contentment is great gain. Dear God, as I seek financial prosperity, I ask for the grace to be content with what you give me. Your teachings remind me that genuine prosperity isn't solely financial. It lies in a combination of godliness and contentment. May my heart seek you and not monetary treasures. Help me to keep my heart guarded at all times. Do not let the pursuit of money replace the purpose to which you sent me here. But help me focus on the things that generate wealth things that will glorify your name. Amidst my financial ambitions, may my heart be grounded in appreciation 
for what I have rather than what I crave. Guide me to discover fulfillment and contentment. I choose wealth that brings peace, joy and gratitude. I receive the grace to find joy in being content. Guide my financial decisions and let them align with your plans for me. Lord, I receive peace in my financial life. Every storm that has been raging becomes still now in Jesus' name. I will not lack anything good. I will experience abundance in my finances. Thank you for making a way for my financial prosperity. May your life be filled with abundant blessings from heaven. May the Lord grant your heart's desires and make your wish come true. I pray that you will soar in your finances. You will not lack any good thing. Everything you will need each day has been granted by God. Your needs are met to the fullest. Your life will be a blessing to other people. You will be a blessing to your generation. No more financial obstructions in your life. The way has been paved for you by the Lord. Did you find this content meaningful and would love to see more like it? If yes, leave your comments below and share your experience with others. You never know, your testimony might be of help to someone else. Also, click the like button, share, subscribe, and don't forget to hit the notification bell so that you will be alerted when new videos are available on this channel. See you in our next video.